Hello, internet friends. My name is Bay, and my forehead is full of bursting with Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. But I'm bad. A light commentary playthrough, trying to learn all the different. I just sat here for about 20 minutes looking through all the menus to try to like internalize and find a certain one and look at all the different icons and new stuff. It's a lot. And I'm still trying to figure out how to do all the combat because there's so many more. Just the synergy system is so much more to try to work in. We got some more battle stuff to do here. Stuff. Whoa, sorry, wrong button. I'm used to hitting R1 to run. R R1 is now. Talk about precision defense. That's right. I tell you, I don't like how the materia isn't the first thing you select in the main menu. That might be a set and forget on cloud. The uh, improved parry. Where's this monster at? Oh, right there. Oh, it's up above. Oh. Fiends roam this place. They do red. What do we got up here, though? I'm gonna. I can't just climb this wall, it's too tall. So where am I going? All the way around that way, maybe? That noise might get super annoying. Elephants. Pressure, stagger, defeat, all in time limit. Okay, easy. Never mind. Very short time frame. Let's go. Hell yeah. Oh, we should read what's right. Or fire and then it rampages. So long. I'm okay. 
get rid of. So much health. time 16 seconds um looks like i got no mana hmm little time maybe i should be spamming comet I can only cast one though. them gently um he's just flirting with cloud Okay, so the combat assignments in a zone don't require everything to be perfect to get it all done. So if something has three objectives, you only have to do two, potentially. Some, some zones might require more. But I didn't have to do all of them, as these are both miss, all missing one. But if you do all of them, is there something else you get? I have, I have no idea. I thought there'd be a lot of fast traveling in this game and just doing this. You're just blooping around to fast travel points. I've been doing this a lot. I foresee a lot of this. Because you fight, you burn all your resources, you sit, you repeat. For a normal playthrough, anyway. That's not gonna work in, uh. Okay, fine. Not gonna work in hard mode. Now. Check out the VR. Oh, uh. Junon's Chocobo Ranch. Perhaps you were already aware, but the Chocobos here are raised on a diet of feed, seaweed, and fishbone meal. Unsurprising, given the local industry. Yo, Chadley. Nice shorts. 
Okay. So this is sick. Material that's duo elements. You choose which one. It's so good. Oh, and it costs data points to buy. So do you get more data points if you do all three objectives on a hunt? at the same time. So many. Oh my god. The tutorials, the region we're in, and the assignments. Oh, okay. I would assume these tutorial ones would be way earlier in the game. But they're only available now because we literally haven't been able to do them yet. Some of these simulations will allow you to use abilities you may not have learned yet. Oh, it has to be Cloud Barrett. Oh, yeah. Dude, look at the high res images of these handsome boys. beginning of the game stuff, but it's here because we didn't do these at the beginning of the game. To go off of what you're talking about in chat, the uh, the progression that carries over from the demo to the main game is the ability to skip the Sephiroth section we did in the earlier section. You can skip that sequence if you want to, because you've already done it. And I think like the Chocobo stuff will already be unlocked, like the fast travel points when you get to this area. You don't keep your items or XP to what I understand. It's just like some of the story unlocks would would stay. You might not actually not keep anything from this section, but I imagine the, the right up the post might have more information. So the bing, bing, bing is a while airborne. It was marked with will launch grounded characters into the air. Hmm. Okay. So bing, bing, bing in air. And then one swoosh is to get launched. So like you can use braver in the air. Triple slash will send you airborne. Focus thrust is nothing. Fireball Blade will send you airborne. Right. 
immediately interrupted. You're dead. All right. No, no. I mean, the progress carrying over to me doesn't matter because I'm just going to do this section over again anyway when I play the game for real next week. They had to figure out some way to at least let you keep certain things from the previous game so you weren't just totally resetting, even though you kind of are. They've definitely chosen a lot of stuff. So that you're not just losing your entire Samus suit, not essentially. Bad. Indeed. See, this over fire material we already have. So. Let's do the synergy one. I'm assuming you're going to get these all in chapter one. Yes. Counter fire clouds counter dance from the first game. Maybe. Let's try again. Yes. What the? Ready? It is a smaller. Another one in the bag. 
All right, what about regions? Oh. There it is. So I have enough to unlock the region. But there's a... This is getting the other three optionals that I haven't gotten. I believe. Unless there's just more full-on three more battles. It might be either four, three more full battles, or it's that I don't have all the intel. Aerith, come on. You can only be so cute. Good God. Catwolf. We had a bit of a discussion in Discord of the night about what Red is. He's a cat wolf in the official lore. He's a cross between a, a lion and a wolf. So I gotta look at this again. If she soul drains, Thank you. someone looks kind of shaky. She just gains one soul drain. There's so much damage now. What the heck? Fight the single target nuke. All right. Yeah, so this I'm not sure. Assignments. White Squall. I'm assuming this is going to be stuff we just already fought, potentially. I want to do Comet and just yeet all of his mana. Can she have both wards out at once? I should get charged. 
Is she ward in the ward? Let's get serious. Well, yes, but sorry about that. That's it. I have to. So much it's a so whole mana pool. That's pretty good damage. Let's go. Ready with me. Ready to fight this copy. You're up. Right. Copy. Cosmos. What's the mean? That's such a crazy move. Let's go. Okay. So that is definitely this whole game now is is getting that the timings down for those. I got carried Leave away. Oh, uh, whoops. This is here. Now's our chance. Ready or not? Here I go. So get two elemental materia this whole game like the first one elemental materia is just so good set and forget okay conqueror of the skies so one owl and one of the bird probably Ghost the owl first.
Oh, okay. He has a deal with. This bird sucks, man. Super annoying. It just it just picks people and just stuns locks them and they can't do anything. Super obnoxious. That sure is an attack. It was. Spirit up. I gotta see if that is something I need more. I gather from your expression that you're eager for more. Needless to say, many hazards await you on the road, so take care. Okay, his his icon had a little materia blob on it when it had new stuff. Okay. Fast travel, I assume. <gasps> it's customizing your chocobo. Oh my god. The true end game. Hey, what? For his gear, not for him or her. Do you color their gear? Oh, see, so do you might have to capture different chocobos? Oops. To have actual different chocobos. This is a black chocobo, so you have a black chocobo. So if you get yellow and red and blue and all the other colors, maybe? Hmm. That would be wild. What in the... It's the cat clock, but it's Chocobo instead. I like it. 
<laughs> I mean, he didn't jump on, but. So the purple armor. Good thing they decided to go with Witcher style gathering and not actually have animations for it, because who cares? machine in the middle of the wherever the hell we are indeed no I don't I don't nah some some games it's helpful and and immersive to have required three some games it's helpful to have the animations of your character like kneeling down and picking up stuff or whatever but in some games like in in the witcher who doesn't it doesn't matter and this it doesn't i don't think it matters you want to see cloud bend down and pick up three twigs six thousand times as you walk by stuff this whole game no absolutely not wait one cost 50. Which, what is the, oh, on sale wind materia. You ever think for a moment, item master material becomes even stronger now because you can spam potions to heal you between combat. You go to a vending machine and then there's street and you just pick up some fire material or lightning material. I'll take that materia. Oh, cool. Now I can, you know, go yeet all this trash or or uh power my house for however long with my lightning materia converter and then you just like you're a freaking firebender so what does this mean required three is it for crafting what does that mean Yeah, item master seems like it actually went up a lot in in power getting a lot of material now doesn't really mean a whole lot oh so does that thing still stay on sale i, mean, I won't need it 100 gold though now the other question is how does that system work because you can kind of cheese that system in the uh first thing whoops so used to that being run. Business is booming at our one-stop fashion shop. What? The real end game. Give that bird a pat on the head for me. I know I just dyed all the armor he was wearing, but come on. Whoa, what's going on? Whoa, whoa, whoa. That was weird. Sure. Can still edit the colors, though. That's cool. Only clouds, though. Screw when else Chocobo. They're plain Janes. All right, well, we did that. Let's at least go to the fortress. That's the wrong button. Now. 
Let's go. You're up. Now. Ready? Let's do this. I love seeing the other characters still in the distance. Blacking old Nick construction worker chocobo. I must be immersed. Chocobo barding. Hell yeah. How'd you know that bird was hostile? When you got close enough, the middle the aggro sphere. The aggro crag. So let me see. Mm -hmm. Need a lot of materials to craft some of these things though, for sure. Phoenix Draft revives them for a small of HP. Oh, it means on a to do list, I think. You just craft elixirs. I rare the materials for that. So all of this is Junon? Everything above us. Below is under Junon. Little more than an impoverished fishing village. <laughs> Figures. Shinra's always gotta have someone to stomp on. It's their friggin' M.O. One moment. <laughs> Welcome to Under Junon, our sunless oasis. My name is Rhonda. I'm the mayor and sheriff around these parts. Rhonda Pog. richer for it <laughs> well you know what they say can't take it with you hmm. <laughs> hmm. holy and Aerith to boot huh that's another 
half a million on top. Uh, half a million? <laughs> <laughs> Down here, though, we know when to turn a blind eye. Consider our lips sealed. Uh, sorry, but I call bullshit. Well, I don't think you would if you knew even half of what my town's been through. You don't like it? Leave. But over there, there's a quiet little inn where everyone's welcome. <laughs> I like how for the three of us knuckleheads, I don't think red's included, right? 100,000 gil. Just Aerith? Half a million. That's why she got the big bright eyes. It's just like, wow, I'm worth a lot. <laughs> the bounty on my head is crazy. Behave yourselves now. <laughs> Such an uh, absolute dork. Look, another city underneath a big city. I think it is. Quickly, please. Yeah, Priscilla. Yeah. I'm good. Help quickly! This Hold way. on, I gotta sit down. down here. Hey, look out. Quickly, please. Okay. Help! Yeah! <laughs> Yuffie, come on. Is that Leviathan? to the gang. Hey, I've done this boss in 14. Come on. Oh. No time to do anything Shit. sometimes it feels like in this game now. <laughs> what did I say? Yeah. <laughs> 
interrupted immediately. Hold tight, okay. Shit, man. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Stop it already. Get him. I have no ATB and my Okay. You'll see. Okay. 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 <laughs> that did cat do shit, man. Holy crap, this game is so aggressive. I'm here. Going all Just here. taking a right little break. break. <laughs> Let's finish this. I have to at least get the limit break in, right? Any last words? Hold on, Aerith. Thank you, Cloud. Calling fire. Dude. So that's the way it's gonna be, huh? That boy. All right. Full on wipe. I know you. Holy crap, man. <laughs> oh my god. The game is so aggressive now. I have no ATB. I try to get ATB. Stun to the person trying to get ATB. Swap to the other person to try to get that person out of the stun. That person then gets put in a bubble. Swap to the third person to get the person out of the bubble. That person gets hit for half their health, knocked over. While I can't do anything to build ATB because I'm stunned. I have two characters. Like, holy crap. Hit me, I was in the air. This is a bad team comp for this. It just gave me Aerith and Tifa, though. I don't think they were in my comp. I thought I had Red and Tifa. So, best do it right. Of course, weak to lightning, which I don't have anything on. It's lightning. <clears throat> okay. TB to do something. Holy crap. That still hits me, even though I dodge. All right. Hold tight, okay. Pop it. You'll be blown away. Hurry. It does, okay. Just a spell. Can you take over for me? Now. Oh my god. I'll show you what I Together? Gotta 
Dude. You'll be out before you know it. <laughs> this is actually insane. That's it. Not over yet. This one's for you. No big deal. Dude, what the fuck? I can't build ATB if I'm dodging. <laughs> this is absolutely mental. This is harder than anything I'm doing in a hard mode right now. Oh my God. I need to get Tifa up though. Never mind. Eric. <laughs> Wait, seriously? Dude, just kill me, man. Holy crap. I just wish I could. Can I change my comp and put some lightning on, I guess? Oh my god. And now I can't sit. Hilarious. It did change my squad when I walked in. Weird. All right, hold on. I just wiped two times to this boss in the demo. And in my entire playthrough of Remake, I wiped three times. Maybe four. I don't think the, the VR simulator doesn't count. Holy, holy crap. Keep forgetting. We need to like limit siphon early and then limit break with Aerith. I don't think we have a raise material, do we? Yeah, this is this is this is nuts. <laughs> Demo boss harder than Sephiroth and boss of the entire first game. Like no joke. I got one shot that fight. I guess spoilers if you haven't watched the series yet, but This is bonkers, man. again.
Yeah. Keep it together. About damn time. Is he not weak to lightning? I have lightning on. Two summon time. I gotta heal. Keep your eyes on the water. I'm still kicking. I know. I'll show you what I can do. Shit. I'll take care of you. Tifa?
Oh my god. <laughs> Two with Cloud. Hey, it's your turn. Bring it home. Hang back. Gotta heal first. Damn it. Do it. Immediately grab. Just another Thundara, please, I guess. Oh my goodness. Wowza. Coffin? Coffin? Yeah, holy crap. That was... That was so much harder. It feels like you just build, you build ATB so much more slowly. So maybe I don't know all the breadths of, of how to teeter totter on, on which items to use or which abilities to use to learn how to be better about keeping my team up. Cause it just doesn't seem like the AI on these two boss fights I've done, doesn't seem like they just target the person that's controlling. They just kind of target everybody now randomly, even though I went to cloud and I got tail grabbed or whatever. I did do better dodging on that one. So I think it's a little more sporadic now. So there's probably certain items or abilities. Items only work in normal mode playthrough though, so that won't work in hard mode. But, um... There's a lot. That was harder than the end boss of Remake because of how much slower your decisions are. Or at least at this point, how much less time you have to do to build ATB. And in that squad, I had two abilities that I couldn't do synergistic building, which is also a big deal, is having two people build ATB at the same time, which is great. But... I didn't have enough time to do that because either someone was always in a bubble or someone was always trapped. So that's a wild amount of move to this character, 
get off one ability, move to this character, heal, move to the other character, do one ability, move back to the other character, get some auto attacks in the build ATB, move back to the other character, turn to a synergy move, they get stunned, move back to the other character. Like it's, it's a lot of that now. Whereas you can get away in remake with just essentially casting haste on two people and then just attacking as cloud or Barrett like the whole time. You just blast. So it's the the difficulty is is ramping up, it would seem. Because this is almost as many times as I wiped in all of the previous game in 48 hours in just this boss fight. So a lot to learn. Understand build and, and figure out but that's pretty wild awesome thank you for watching if you're watching on youtube or if you're watching live we'll be back to hard mode stuff the hard mode stuff for seven remake will just be on the stream I'm not gonna make videos about that or whatever because it's just it's extra and it's a terrible way to watch the game because i'm just skipping every cutscene because all i'm doing is trying to do combat challenges and 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 uh level up stuff and make like final end game builds and things like that so wow Wow. Damn. <laughs> it's going to be a crazy 100 hours starting next week. Yep. <laughs>